Hello and welcome to my 12th and my last uh, beginner's C++ tutorial. Uh, we're going to be closing with a switch statement. So let's just get an integer called answer and we're going to uh, input something in the screen or output something. So we're going to say how many legs do you have? And uh, we're just going to end the line. So and then we're going to give um, a user an option to answer so we put the ci in answer command so the way the switch statement works is you type in switch and um, in parentheses you're just going to type in answer which is your integer you worked with and then you're going to put a bracket like this so case one meaning if the user inputs if he answers I have one leg then I want it to output in the screen you are a pirate and end the line and and in these case uh, switch things what you want to do is you want to put a break so it doesn't come all bunched up together so case two if they put I have two legs then um, all you want to put is um you want to see out on the screen you are a human and the line and don't forget the break and um, in the third case let's say we have three cases and if they say I have three legs then we want it to input I do not know what you are and uh, we're gonna end the line so this is how you do a switch case statement and at the end all you want to do is just close it so um, let's see if it works if I didn't make any mistakes how many legs do you have you type in one you are a pirate you type in two you are a human and uh, let's go ahead and type in three I do not know what you are so what the switch statement does is it allows you to not always use the if else statement and uh, it's good when you have uh, options from one to three it's it's a good thing to use and do study this um, thanks for uh, watching these tutorials uh, I would try to uh, make some intermediate C++ tutorials when I have the time. Uh, thanks for watching and bye.